Hi, I'm J.R. Mounts, an independent comics creator and musician. Since 2010, I've created original comics and characters for my business, Scary Tales Noir, where I've traveled all over the U.S. at various comics conventions to promote my original comics. You can see samples of all my works at my website, scarytalesnoir.com. Just remember to add an I to scary. There you can see samples of all my comics for Fried Pickle Noir, which is kind of like Sin City meets Veggie Tales, and it features the tales of Q Cumbersome, as well as the scary tales, the not-so-scary fairy tales, which is like Calvin Hobbes meets Nightmare Before Christmas. On January 11th, my new campaign goes live on Kickstarter for my all-new story with all-new characters. It's called Silver Linings, a story about an old man and an alien. It's a classic adventure along the lines of E.T. or Super 8 and features all the same wonder, excitement, and drama. It also has a fun retro feel to this Man Befriends Alien tale. The main character is called Angus Hort, an elderly retired farmer and widower whose life has just become even more empty after the death of his brother Malcolm. He lives in a part of Dubuque, Iowa that is slowly fading away. He's the last of the farmers in his area, yet he refuses to sell his land leaving it all to wither away as much as he is, day by day. He and the other retirees live in green pastures, jokingly called Widower's Row, because the ones left are the men who'd rather live out their days in desolate single-room condos rather than socialize. They're all wasting away and alone. One day, while visiting his farm, Angus hears something crash into his barn from the skies. Inside, he discovers it's an alien from space. But this isn't the monsters he's seen in the movies. It's a timid, benevolent creature that's wounded and in need of his help. It's part of a locust-like species, species it calls the Brutes, which can destroy entire worlds with their hunger. Angus bonds with this creature and calls it Skip for the way it walks. Then something else crashes in Dubuque, and we discover the bottom half of Skip has survived, the mouth. With Skip's help, it's going to take all of Angus's experience and wisdom to try and save Dubuque, the world, and each other. Silver Linings is a challenging project that will have many new firsts for me. It'll be my first sequential art epic in 8x10 size format, and after it's inked, it'll all be done in watercolor, marking the first watercolor project I've ever done. Color's been something that's intimidated me from the beginning, and now I'm taking a risk for this tale. In addition to that, I've written an all-instrumental score to be performed by myself, with performances and orchestrations by two of my best friends, Mike McQuaid on piano and Tom Mathis on drums. Writing, drawing, and recording is currently underway and I'm shooting for an October 2018 release at the very, very latest. You can see samples at my website right now on the Silver Linings page and I'll have links of all my social media campaign itself on January 11th on Kickstarter. So take a look, get, get excited, and spread the word. I'm JR Mounts and I thank you for all your support.